Hi guys, this is Jason with Smile Mobile. Today we're going to talk to you about uh, setting up an ad campaign for your website or your business through LinkedIn. So those of you who follow us on SmileAndMobile.com, you'll know that we just uh, launched a new international calling service called SmileAndTalk.com. See it over here, Smile and Talk, and you can visit it over there at SmileAndTalk.com. So today what we're going to do is set up an ad campaign on LinkedIn to try and reach more users. All right, for, zo for those of you who don't know what LinkedIn is, if you're hiding under a rock somewhere, LinkedIn is another social network, but they primarily focus on uh, careers and uh, you know networking. There's uh, over 200 million users worldwide. You know They have their resumes on there, their skill sets, and people basically use LinkedIn to build their businesses, to improve their networks, to find jobs, things like that. So to get started, come to linkedin.com slash ads, then click on start now. You will be brought to the create ad campaign page. First, create your ad campaign name, ad campaign name. Then at this point, choose your language, you have other choices, and your media type. In this case, we're going to keep it basic, but you have the option to choose a video. Type in your website here that you want to advertise, smileandtalk.com. Enter a headline, a catchy headline. Notice that whatever you're entering here is now being previewed over here. Then also enter your description over here. You will also have the option to add an image and then you click on next. This is the targeting stage. This is where you choose the people you want to target. Right now it's targeting basically the LinkedIn community over 173 million people. You can be more specific in your targeting, like you can decide to target only people in Asia or in Europe. You can decide to target only people with, uh, who are consultants, for example, senior consultants, things like that. But as you can see, the more you add some specific targeting features, the lower the number of people you're targeting is. Let's see what happens if we click next. Now we'll look at payment method, daily budget, lead collection for your ad campaign. And under payment method, you have the option to either uh, choose a pay-per-click method or a pay per 1,000 impressions. If you pay per click, when people click on your ad, they will charge you whatever you've put in your bid over there. They give you a range, and over here you see the range is between $2 and $2.41. Uh, the higher you, you bid in your range, uh, the more likely that you will... Uh, get those impressions. Your daily budget is basically the limit to the amount of money you want to spend on your ad campaign for that day. So if you have a $2 cost per click and five people have clicked, that's $10. If you have a daily budget of $10, after that they'll stop showing impressions of your ad so that you won't exceed your $10 daily budget. You have the option to have lead collection which basically means that people will, there will be a way for people to leave their information so that you can contact them later. And in the bottom here, there's a show my campaign. And you can have the option whether you want to show it until a specific date or just show it continuously. Okay, the ad campaigns are set. Now let's look at some data. We have two days of data available right now, and we already have some clicks. If we look down at our data for the ad campaign, there have been seven clicks for, for over 28,224 impressions. And so that gives us a click-through rate of 0.025%. Uh, the click-through rate is calculated by taking the number of clicks divided by the number of impressions of that ad. There are zero leads, but that's only because we did not set up the lead collection. And the average uh, cost per click was $2, of course. And uh, the total amount spent, if the average cost per click was $2, would be $14 because it's 2 times the 7. That equals 14 we had a daily budget of $10, so that means on the first day we hit that daily budget because we had five clicks, 
at two dollars per click that was ten dollars and on the second day we have gotten two clicks and we'll probably have three more clicks before we hit the budget for the second day thanks for watching my name is Jason at smile and mobile you can follow our blog at smileandmobile.com or follow us on Twitter at smile and mobile